explosion follows a massive fire that tore through several businesses overnight. It's happening in the area right near the Orleans Casino. It's on camera, and that's right near Decatur and Harmon. Going to get show you a little perspective. There's the Orleans. There's the Palms. Right in the center there is where we're seeing the fire. And we do have Chopper 13 up this morning, fast and first over it. And we're getting our first live aerial pictures, and you can see all the damage in the building there. And the roof caved in. Did still see some smoking as well. So let's get over to Parker Collins, who's been live on the scene since 4 this morning with the very latest. Dana, we just got an update from firefighters and a few minutes ago I saw them put this tape up. They don't want anybody going near this building because as you can see, the roof has basically gone. It's in danger of collapsing. That's their fear. So they're not letting anybody go close to it. Even now, hours after this started, we're seeing smoke kind of come up there. Mostly at this point it's out, but at one point overnight they had to pull firefighters from other parts of the valley. They had up almost close to 100 firefighters working on this at one point. This is basically a city block and they had to block off a lot of these streets around it for all their fire engines. We have learned that a firefighter was taken to the hospital because of this, but he's not really badly hurt. He's already been released and is back on the scene. They haven't heard of any other injuries at this point and they don't yet know what caused this, but they know at least two businesses over here destroyed. Reporting live, Parker Collins, 13 Action News.